everyone and welcome back to Catharsis Inc. So today I'll be doing a craft and office haul. So anything organizational related or office or craft related I'll have in this haul. And I went to Target, Five Below, Walmart, Joann's, Michael's and Tuesday morning. So without further ado, let's get started. So I'm going to be starting with the bigger organizational stuff first. So these things here I found in Target, the dollar section, they were $5. And they're really neat because you can adhere them to the bottom of your desk. So they're pull out drawers and you just, there's uh, sticker adhesives here. So you place it up underneath your desk and it adheres to the bottom of your desk. And then you can just pull out your drawers when you need it. So it'd be good for pens and pencils, rulers. Even if you wanna put it um, under your craft table, it'd be good for stickers and embellishments as well. And then at Target, I also picked up this organizational drawer and then this organizer that you can set right on top of it. They're actually made for each other and they were both $5 each. And like I said, the one is just a drawer so you can pull that out. And I believe I got two drawers and then this top holder, which be, would be good for markers, colored pencils, pens, pencils, rulers, or any type of your craft supplies, like your tapes and glues and stuff like that. So I picked those up for on top my craft table. And then if you watched my other Target haul, I had gotten some of those white bins. They were smaller, but I found these extra large bins as well. So I picked two of those up and these were $5 each. And they're just like the smaller ones where they slide out and can stack on each other. So that's really nice. And then at five below in the dorm room section, I found this really neat collapsible crates and it's a set of two and they had a few different colors, um, but I picked up the black and it shows you a picture here. They stack one on top of each other and these would be good for any type of craft items that you have, um, like your bigger items. Like I have boxes of projects. They're like smaller boxes that come like kits and stuff like that. So those would be good to fit in here or any type of your, your bigger craft or office items. And then at Five Below, I also picked up this under bed organizer which ideally they are for clothes or blankets and extra pillows that you can put under your bed. But I also like to use them for bigger uh, items that I craft with. So like my metal wreath holders or any of my florals that are longer and I haven't used or cut up yet, those go really well in here as well. And then from five below also, I got this really pretty calculator. And I, if you don't know, I actually do some accounting work. So I constantly am in need of calculators for doing that. And at five below, I also found these pretty color fountain pens and it comes in eight different inks. And they're just so pretty. And they actually have the calligraphy tip so the quill nib. And then I also find, found these kindness cards at Five Below and I just thought they were so cute. And they say a quote on one side and on the other, then it asks a question. So like this one says, why I feel grateful for you. And then you write your answer in and then you can actually give these cards away. So I'm really into stationery and stuff. So I thought those were really cute. You could send those to your pen pals or, or anything like that. It's just a nice gesture. And then I found these really cute mini book bags that you can attach to your purse or your book bag or something like that. And it holds your mini 
like this shows it holds your mini office supplies so like a mini stapler mini pen any type of binder clips uh paper clips or anything like that i thought that was so cute so i picked one of those up so i just opened this little book bag up and it has stuff in it <gasps> Shut the front door. Look how cute this little composition book is. Oh my god. This is like mini heaven. Look at this little tape. Oh, that's so dear. And there's a little, is this a ruler? Oh my god. So this is everything that came inside. This is a pen and a marker, an eraser, a little tiny stapler, like get out of here. It's so cute. A little clip so you can clip it onto your book bag. Oh, I did not know it actually came with stuff in it. That is so exciting. And I forgot to mention, I also went to Hobby Lobby and I found this really pretty fabric ribbon. And it says, you are my sunshine. And I believe this was on Clarence. But it's so pretty. I thought it was, it could be good for fall or any type of project that you just want to add some pretty yellow into. This would be gorgeous. Then I also found these little containers that I'm going to be putting in my craft room as well. These were only $1.99. And I found those at Hobby Lobby as well. I thought those were so cute. And they could fit like different types of stickers and embellishments in as well. And then the only thing I found at Walmart, if you didn't know, Walmart's coming out with a dollar section as well, like Target has. I found this really cute tape, what are they calling it? Mini tape gun in the in the dollar section this was actually five dollars and it comes with of course one tape gun and then two rolls of tape but i thought this would come in handy for my small business when i'm packaging up my orders so i picked that up and they had a few different colors of that as well oh i did get something else at walmart i forgot there are these cute little binder clips and they have like little smiley faces and winky faces on them they're so cute I am definitely a office supply nerd and I love when they come out with the back to school stuff because they come out with these cute little office supplies and I just have to pick them up. <laughs> okay, moving back on to Target, I found this really neat ultrasonic portable humidifier and it was in the dollar section and it's five dollars. So. When they come out with the back to school stuff and the dorm stuff, I definitely go check that out because it's always neat little stuff. You just stick it into a water bottle and then it humidifies a small room for you. So I picked that up for beside my bed at night since it gets dry down there with me having the fan on. And then I also found these cute little stretchy binder and book covers. I thought they were so cute, but it says counting down the days. Just kidding. I love school. <laughs> now if you don't know I am currently in college I'm going for my bachelor's degree in creative writing so I thought this was so cute I always love school I'm, I'm such a nerd I love writing essays and and doing all the the school things so this was this was so cute I had to get that one I also found this cute little pizza one and then this tie-dye one but I thought these would be cute to put around my uh, solid color binders just to give them a fun little pop. And then I picked up these erasable highlighters. Now I had recently hauled these from Michaels out of the clearance section, but when I tried them out, like two of them didn't even highlight at all. One was like dried up and then the other two worked. So hopefully, uh, these ones that I got at Target will work fine because I'm really excited that they're pastel colors. I think they're so pretty. The next items I got were from Michaels. And these were out of the dollar section of Michaels. And they're these pretty pastel tie-dye gel pens. 
and then these primary color gel pens and they look glittery so i thought they were so cute so i picked those up and then i got myself more of those jelly roll pens one's like a what would you call that maybe a maroon or purpley mauve um glittery color and then the other one is periwinkle Then in the clearance section, I found this cute little ribbon that says it's game time. And my, all my kids are into gaming, so I thought this would be cute for maybe wrapping Christmas gifts or their birthday gifts or even when I do some type of party, like their last birthday party, I did it um, PlayStation themed. So that would be cute as well to use for that. And then I found some Sweet Kawaii Design sticker sets. And there's, let's see, there's 320 pieces in here. So there's all kinds of different stickers. They're so cute. I love Kawaii stickers. They're so precious. And then I also found some kawaii washi tapes. So I thought those were so cute as well. And then also in the dollar section, they have stuff for tie-dye kits. And I found these really cute, look at this one with the bow. It's really cute white scrunchies. So it comes with two regular and then one with the bow, and they're perfect for tie-dyeing. So once I start my tie-dye craft, I'm gonna be tie-dyeing these as well. I thought that would be so cute. And then I found this sticker folio Harry Potter set of 436. Thought they were so cute. Here are the designs on the back. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan if you didn't know. My obsession is quite ridiculous. <laughs> if you get that joke, you are awesome. <laughs> and then I found this horizontal planner and it's got a typewriter on it, guys. It's absolutely beautiful. I love it. And then the back has a little flower on it. But if you didn't know, obviously I'm a writer. I'm going to school for creative writing. So I just thought this was so gorgeous. But this is for 2021 2022 and it starts with july so this month and then it goes all the way to 2022 december so it's really nice it's a really nice calendar i won't show you inside because i might do a planner video like i did last year i might do one at the end of december so i don't want to show you inside yet Oh, I just found two more pens that I got. So there's another periwinkle and a metallic green. And then moving on to Joann's, I found this beautiful Park Lane Woodland scrapbooking paper. And it has beautiful bugs and nature themes. And it was right up my alley, so I picked that up. It's so beautiful. I love those designs. And I got some more Harry Potter stuff. This is a 12 inch paper pack. So there's two each of six double sided designs. And here's one of the pages. Thought that was really cute. Eventually I wanna do a Harry Potter scrapbook. I thought that'd be really cute. So I picked those up. And, oh, here's some more Harry Potter stuff. There's these mini stickers. And the back side is the same. And then here's some more stickers. And the back shows you the different varieties. And then these 3D Harry Potter stickers. They're so cute. And then I found these really cute country stickers. 
So I have England. My son is fascinated with England. So I picked these up for him. And then my daughter is fascinated with Canada. So I picked these up for her. And then both me and my son love Ireland. So I got these as well. And then on the back of these, it's not more Ireland, but it's travel stickers. So I was kind of bummed about that, but at least we get the front with Ireland. And then I found this beautiful, what are they calling this? This is called a dimensional sticker of a beautiful tree. I just love that. This I think I'm going to use in my book of shadows. And then I found these cute little um, acrylic stickers, one of a panda. So this one's going to be for my sister. And they had a whole bunch of different ones. And they're, they're like hard. Well, they say they're acrylic, so they're hard. And then on clearance, I found this cute little patch. I couldn't believe it. It's so adorable. So I picked that up as well. And then also on Clarence, I hit the jackpot, guys. I found these cute little stamps, and I tried taking the Clarence sticker off so you could see it, but this one says, Truly, Madly, Deeply. This one says, Bon Voyage. And then this one is a traveling theme pack. So cute. And then the last store that I went into was Tuesday Morning. And if you don't know what that is, it kind of reminds me of like a TJ Maxx or Ross or Marshalls. But they have some craft stuff. They have a whole craft aisle. So I picked some stuff up. I picked this mini stamp pads up. And it comes with all different colors. I, there's six different colors in here. So I picked those up. Then I picked this 12 pack of paint sticks up. And I was looking. It kind of looks like a crayon like a paint crayon. I'm not sure though, but it sh kind of shows it on the back. But I thought that was really cool. I, I've been wanting to try out gelatos and I haven't gotten any, but this seems like really close to it. So I'm gonna try these out. And then I got some scrapbooking paper and it's so cute. It's like different types of concession foods. It's pretzels, pizza, ice cream, drinks and this whole pack includes those types of paper in it and then i found this scrapbooking pack uh it's a park lane and it's called rainy days it's got cute little umbrellas some gnomes and mushrooms thought that was so cute hot air balloons i just love it it's so cute but that's everything that I got for this haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.